Hello everyone, this is Shane with Velocity Multirotors and today I'm going to show you guys a new new way of mounting the failsafe arm button for most Pixhawk flight controllers. In fact, you can use this button on any of them. Um, I'm using the button from the Pixhawk Lite and I rewired it to work on the Pixraptor flight controller. The uh, reason why is because it is the perfect size to fit into your gimbal tubes, into your mounting mounting tubes. And that protects the wire, gives it a place to uh, to mount. So it's not, you know, you got to have a hole to, to, to plug it in. That way it's stabilized and it keeps, it keeps you from breaking the wires off the end. So let me show you how it looks. Of course, I put it on the back, and uh, of course, we press that button after we've gained a GPS lock and stuff like that to uh, to arm the ESCs. What I had to do is I mounted the the, the uh, tube, turned it sideways, and then or turned it to where the I could drill a, or had it to where I drilled a hole into the side and then turned it you know after I fed the wire through and then I turned it to where it faces up and then it comes through the the, the uh, mounting plate one of the slots in the mounting plate and just comes up and goes into the back of the flight controller the holes not big enough to uh, disrupt the uh, integrity of the tube so that's that's perfect to do it that way I also heat shrinked over the wire that way, because uh, carbon fiber is conductive, and then if you happen to cut through two wires on this, it would short whatever circuit it's on. And it's got three. It's got a common ground, and then an LED uh, power line, and the switch wire to arm it. And that's it. I just wanted to show you guys that, uh, how clean it came out, how nice it is. I'll turn it around. I've got a few more things I want to do to clean the wires up. I want to try to get this cleaned up better. I've never really had good success at cleaning up servo leads. Um, they just all come to one place. You have, you know, three, four, six, eight. You have plenty of them. And uh, I tried to, sh you know, I definitely shortened these some because the leads that come with these X rotor ESCs are, are very long. So I, uh, I spliced them and shortened them up to get rid of most of the wire. But that's it for this video. Thanks for watching.